I'm Nadi Mahmud from Project Defy. I'm very happy to see the commitment and involvement they are putting forward for making their idea real. I'm wishing them all the best. Nothing to beat hard work, nothing to beat spending maximum time on the products. Each one of you is thinking differently and that, that makes you different from your peers, that makes you different from your colleagues, that makes you different. And the inspiration of the solution is that particular meme which says different a type of uh, stresses, headaches are felt in different parts of the head. Uh, that's like bringing down the cost by uh, multiple folds. A wonderful demonstration from all the students over here and it is what I was always looking what every IOT person thinks about and talks about is like internet of things is everywhere you have to move with the change if you are not going with the pace then you are missing something and I really appreciate the effort that was put in by Amrita University along with the Cisco everyone together coming in and giving up their complete effort With very low cost, we are making a robot which will help you in domestic chores. The product is a cost-efficient home security for the visually impaired. The problem we aim to solve is the reduction of the wastage of electricity in firms. This project is based on blockchain technology and how it is used to eliminate uh, real estate transactions. Our project is to design a low-cost steering aid. It is basically designed of a helmet for two-wheelers to prevent accidents. So our project is audio guide for patients. So the problem statement that we have chosen to solve is to detect depression using EEG sensor. And our project for today is driver alertness detection system. We are developing a VR game for uh, back pain re relieving. Students with aspiring vision for technology and want to make something innovative can explore incubator makerspace. The doors of incubator makerspace will be always open for certain miles. In Amada Vishwavidya Bidam, we had around 500 applications for from cohort 1 and 2 and we selected around 50 applications uh, which consist of around 150 students and from that on itself we have selected three teams which they went to Bangalore and they exhibited their project and they made changes there. So I am expecting around uh, 500 applications more from Amrita Vishwavidya Bidam. Anyone who is interested to explore this ecosystem, explore this makerspace, can visit Thinkubator anytime and I'm always I'm happy to welcome all students to Thinkubator.